at the end of this first episode, Bernard kind of owns up to this event. Um, what was the goal of that final scene, and what is it going to set up moving forward? I think the goal is, in the, in the first season, we were playing cards down with the way in which the host's memory works. Which is to say, through the first season, you're not aware that Dolores is actually remembering things and mistaking them for reality. One of the things we were excited about in the second season was you now play cards up with the idea that hosts mistake their memories for reality, get lost in time, bounce back and forth. So Bernard's awareness of what happened and the fact that he doesn't seem to remember a lot of what happened is something that, uh, that we like to play with through the season. He's a bit of an unreliable performer. Jeffrey's a lovely person, but Bernard is a bit of an unreliable narrator for the second season. <laughs> And so the jumping around of time periods was something that fans were kind of guessing at at the end of last season. Did you guys pick up on that and decide to pursue it further, or was it something you already had set in mind and it was just cute to... Uh, you know, I think it was kind of embedded in the DNA of the show.